Listen up, history buffs. A new exhibit is opening at the Allen County Public Library's Kroll Library Gallery. And it aims to highlight stories and images of our nation's 16th president, Abraham Lincoln. And here to join us today is Stephanie Smith and Emily Raposa. Good morning, ladies. Thank you for Good joining morning. us. Good morning. How are you guys? We're doing great. Good. Yeah. Exciting time over at the library. Uh, so tell us, what what's going on this exhibit? Yeah, we are so excited about this exhibit. It's called History Speaks, uh, Stories from the Lincoln Collection. And a lot of people don't realize that when the Lincoln Museum closed down, um, a lot of these artifacts stayed right here in Fort Wayne. So they think all those, those pictures and the diaries, all these cool things that used to be in the Lincoln Museum disappeared. They didn't. Most of them are still here at the library. And so this exhibit really highlights a lot of those things. And the, those, they didn't go everywhere, but I mean, they, a lot of people wanted them, right? Why did they end up here in Fort Wayne? Yeah, so the Smithsonian Museum was competing for them and the Library of Congress a lot of really prestigious institutions in our country and the state of Indiana actually won so they're divided between the Allen County Public Library and the Indiana State Museum down in Indianapolis um, and we won the collection because we committed to digitizing the collection wow. so putting it online so that no matter where you are you have access to seeing these artifacts and these artifacts you have some pictures with you um, but what what are there is it more than just pictures Emily? It is. So we have all of the paper goods here at the Allen County Public Library. So that's um, not only images and photographs, but also letters, books, diaries, um, everything from Civil War letters to little notes written by Lincoln about his youngest son, Tad, um, and everything in between. Emily, you're holding a document that you're kind of shielding from the light of it. You don't want to get too much light exposure because it is such an old yes. document. But are we able to reveal and talk about yes. what this is? I'm really excited for Absolutely. This. So I have brought two today. So I will show this one first. So this is a composite photo of the Lincoln family. Um, and what's interesting is you look at this photo. It's a very nice family photo. But the Lincolns never sat for a family photo together. Lincoln was only ever photographed with his youngest son, Tad, and so that is the image that makes up the middle of this photo. After Lincoln died, people wanted photos of the family. Mm -hmm. So artists and photographers got together, created these composite images from various other photographs, wow. and then took a photograph of the artwork and sold those off as the family portrait. Wow. That's fascinating. So when does that date from? This would have been after Lincoln, so post-1865, so probably about 66, 67. Wow. Yes. Very cool. You've yeah. got something so else there, I too. do. This is arguably our most famous photo. Um, this is our spirit photo. And Mary Todd had been through a lot of death and despair in her life, oh. and she went and got into spirit photography. I'm and I, I don't this. know if you can see it on there, but there's a little bit of a shell. The spirit. There is. The that. spirit of Lincoln is standing behind wow. her. Um, Mary thought this was very real. So I'll try Yeah, you can. I say you have to angle it, <laughs> yeah, but you can there actually it is. see you that. You can actually it. see Lincoln standing wow. behind her. So this wow. was pure comfort for Mary. This was everything she wanted. Um, there's a ghost here. It's great. Yeah. So this is one of our coolest things um, to get to show off in our collection. Wow. Yeah. And, and how many total pieces are part of this collection? Thousands and thousands. So you can literally spend hours if you go check out the, the yeah. Lincoln Collection. Yeah, if you go online to lincolncollection.org, you can see the items that are at the library, but also the items that are down in Indianapolis at the State Museum. Um, you can come check out the exhibit. We picked what we think are some of the coolest yes. items that also have stories attached to them. So you can come see the exhibit. Or also, our Lincoln librarians love to give tours of other items in the collection. So you can come in during the library's operating hours and come check out the collection in person. Very cool. Thank you so much for showing those. We appreciate it. Well, the exhibit runs through July 9th through September 2nd. And for more information on the exhibit, you can head to acpl.info or call 260-421-1200. And we'll be right back.